It's the video that has people talking. A police chase through a Berea golf course with a tractor leading the way. LEX 18's Ricky Sayer spoke with the 12 year old who was too close for comfort in tonight's big story at six. An attempted getaway on the green. A man driving a tractor hoping police are left trapped in the sand. It's scary. You don't know what he's got on him. You don't know if he has a weapon. You don't know if he has the intent to hurt anybody. Derek Hicks put down his phone as the tractor sped toward his 12 year old son Cooper. I was behind the tree looking through to see where he was going to make sure he wasn't coming towards me. But that's exactly where the man ran after his tractor got stuck along this creek. Your heart sinks and you just have this feeling of helplessness. I was scared. I didn't know what was happening. I just wanted to go home. But in the nick of time. He got tased right here. He was on the ground for a little bit. He went down like a sack of bricks, so it was it was it was it was pretty funny. Police charged Jared Whirl with nine counts, including wanton endangerment and fleeing and evading. An off-duty police officer spotted him getting gas. The chase started at this intersection. You can't escape the police with a tractor. I don't know what he was trying to do there, but police say he nearly ran over two bicyclists. He had a pretty intense look on his face. He was seemed like he was wanting to get away, um, but it did seem like he was like holding his hand up like every time he almost hit a cop car, almost like he was saying sorry. For his son, there is a silver lining. I wasn't playing very good, so I was kind of sad. I was about to go home anyway, so probably saved me if I didn't hit this ball over here. It was shocking, uh, scary, and then also after the end, it's, it was pretty funny too. So Derek's hoping that the only vehicle you see on this course in the future is one of these golf carts. In Berea, Ricky Sayer, LEX 18 News.